Hello, my name is Arun Babar. I work with PwC's Academy in Middle East as a financial trainer. As an organization, we try to identify the skill gaps in the economy and solve the problem by imparting professional qualifications and bespoke corporate training programs. Today, we're going to talk about analysis of financial and non-financial information. The reason we chose this topic is because we are aware there are a lot of analysts out there overwhelmed with the amount of financial and non-financial information. A lot of these analysts find their way right to the bottom of the problem by using this information, while others end up getting confused. The natural response these analysts adopt in such situation is actually to have a preset method of analysis. Such rigid approach might work, might not work on occasions because it does not adapt itself. Unknowingly, analysts might actually end up incorporating a lot of biases that can seriously debilitate the quality of financial analysis they produce. In this session, we'll try to identify some of these high-level problems that the process of analysis can suffer from. We'll try to leave you with some of the best practices that analysts use to overcome these problems. Hence, in this session, we'll try to cover analysis of business and financial information that the annual reports contain. We'll talk about issues around the earnings quality, how to transform the accounting values into economic values so that the important decisions can be taken, and finally, how to identify the traps and biases that can debilitate the process of analysis. We really look forward to seeing you in the session.